What is up, risk takers? Welcome to the Kill Pete Strategy. I am Pete. I'm a top player in Risk Global Domination. I have a daily release on Free Pete, a daily release on the Kill Pete Strategy, and weeknight streams on Twitch. And if you are interested in getting better at the game of Risk, I invite you to subscribe to my channel. Come along the ride with me, folks. If you like the work I'm doing, feel free to click the notification so you get notified for when my next videos come out. We're doing risk videos. These are the meta settings. Europe Advanced Progressive Capitals and uh, Standard Meta for today. Uh, Auto 60 Expert Bot. Didn't start with any progressive cards automated. Uh, fog Blizzards are on. Portals Alliances are off. I'm in the fourth position playing white. I have a good center position. An option to take either of these capitals is quite good. I'm happy with that. So I will... Hopefully control the east-west axis through the middle. Let's see. We don't see any of our first three opponents' capitals. I think I'll choose the, the three on Denark, but that would encourage blue to take that. So I actually think it's smarter for me to put here just to potentially block blue. And put on Dinarides. And claim both middle bonuses as quickly as possible. Okay. Red chooses here. So far, that's the only cap we see. Red's in Istanbul. Me and Red are almost neighbors. Depending on how many troops I get to start, maybe I steal Red's cap turn one. A turn one capital is a bold move, but uh, wouldn't put it past the old Bateman. I think Blue would have wanted to cap on that three, but now they don't. Yeah. Okay, so blue chooses a garbage capital. Don't think red is uh, great, but blue is definitely no good with that cap choice. So we see one, two, three of our opponent's caps in the open. What are the blizzards? Choke up. So the Italy, Sicily, and the Sicily Naples blizzard. The blizzard in Libya here. Who's there? Green is there. Green is here. Wow. Okay. We actually have a lot of capitals in this cluster of the board. Okay, then who's in Noob Corner? Can I snag Noob Corner for free? Well, first of all, let's see how many troops we actually get on our open. If we have enough to take that red for, <clears throat> maybe we do. Red might quit the game from that. And then we just have one less opponent to worry about. Green shows Africa. You don't see magenta. Do we see yellow? Yeah, yellow's noob corner. Okay. All right, so here's my predictions for capital. So we're, we're thinking yellow. We know blue. We know red. We know mine. I'm thinking green. And then I still can't find magenta. Um... That's all one, two, three, four. Yeah, I still don't know where Magenta is. Okay, so seven troops is an 8v4. 8v4 cap roll. <laughs> Do I want to fuck this guy right out of existence? I will show some clemency, and if it turns out that red is an insufferable prick... Then it serves me right. Just take Denark. Might be that Magenta's in Germany. Probably took Germany turn one. Maybe that's good if they get into a war with the noob corner player. How much does red put on cap? Red putting a six up in Russia makes no sense. That's a bad move. Three on capital. Now seven on capital. Let's see if I hold my plus four. Both blue and red I'm not terribly worried about because they chose somewhat risky cap choices. Okay, red's turning out the lights. He's also probably going to connect that stack into his capital. 
No. He's going to use it to take Orient. Finally, Blue's turn. Blue works on North Africa. <laughs> I have a ton of material in there. Okay. Blue would like to be in Italy. Interesting. As soon as he takes it... Oh, man, don't overcommit. You're not leaving any troops on your cap, dude. Oh, no. He's going to have, like, five on his capital. I'll be able to steal it if I hold the bonus. He's Italy. So he chose... <laughs> Blue chose Splitily as his... Oh, my God, it's still a four. <laughs> oh, man. Green. Okay, so green holds that bonus down there. Nine troops, yeah. Green could fuck. Green could fuck Blue out of this position as well. I want that blue cap. That's what I want. I want to go up. I don't want to lose that. Green putting troops somewhere else. I'm a little worried that Magenta breaks me. Hopefully they don't. Okay, green's not hitting that too. If I hold an arc, I can steal the blue capital. That'll make me really happy. We do love our two cap opens, folks. Okay. Magenta getting 10. Does Magenta break Denaric? Do they break Noob Corner? Oh, looks like they break Denaric. Fuck. Too bad for Pete. No, maybe not. Four doesn't break. Four might be guarding. Yeah, looks like he went the other way. Good sitch looking. I don't figure I get broken by yellow. Don't know where magenta is. We don't know where yellow is. No, sorry. Yellow's noob corner. That's right. Did yellow get Iceland? No, yellow didn't finish Iceland. Magenta broke yellow's noob corner. Magenta's now in a fight here. That's great. They went up and around. I love that. I love that. Perfect. You guys stay occupied. I'm going to steal the blue capital. Eighty-eight percent roll. Oh, 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 we get really good dice, and we break his bonus. Yeah. So there's no real possibility of retaliation from blue. That ends blue's game, right? Starting with split elite. Don't take a split bonus. <laughs> guys don't take a shitty cap um blue did just about everything wrong in his open and now his game is over we have two uh we have two capitals we have nine and an eight and we're holding dinaric alps and hopefully we still hold dinaric alps but i don't even care i might actually be able to take splitly here Okay, red still working on Orient. Red choosing a bigger bonus means that it's going to take a couple of turns for them to take it. So hopefully now I can push into a section of the board where nobody is, which looks like up here. Yeah, blue quits, right? Blue's totally fucked. That, my, my, my second turn ended their game. They, they made it, some really bad decisions and I'll, I'll show you, I'll, I'll explain to you a couple of, of uh, where did blue go wrong in this game? First of all, capping here is terrible. Second of all, capping on a one is bad. If you're in the final seat, because someone can take your cap early. Third of all, the bonus you go for early should not be a split bonus because if it is, it's way harder for you to hold that bonus. Um, because if anyone breaks you on either side, you can't retaliate from the other side. So as you see, Blue quits the game. They made they they got to play one turn. Um, don't do what Blue did. Lessons. Don't do what Donnie Blue did. What is his name? General Cordoba. I'm sorry, sir. I fucked you. <laughs> I fucked you real bad. <laughs> I fucked you real bad, sir. Real bad. Oh, it's a cry and shame is what it is. Uh, <laughs> okay. Turn three. Green still holding Africa. Yeah. <clears throat> what does he do? Green's working on a different part of the board now. He's holding his core Africa here. Not expanding into my Africa. Maybe I take this. That would be wild. 
take this. I'm not actually opposed to that. If I can go pop, 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 and then pop, pop, start working on Spain. I like that pocket a lot, as long as green doesn't fuck around. I like that line actually better than this line, but I have to be cool with green. Okay, Magenta getting 11. Five now. I think five still guards. I don't think they go bad neighbor to me in Dinarik. And I'm happy with my caps too, so I'm not going to use capital troops. I'm just going to use new troops to take North Africa, I think. And not piss off green. Maybe green breaks. We'll see. Yellow doesn't look like they're doing too well. Yeah, I think Magenta has won the war with yellow. He's still fighting, though. Fighting the good fight over there. Yeah, I don't think anyone's in Spain. I think Spain's my line. If nobody's taken it. What do we start with? So yellow's still keeping magenta in check. So we're like 15? 12. And pull this back to Maybe the bot breaks actually there. I'm gonna pull this back to capital. If he breaks me, he loses his bonus. Yeah. Yeah, blue's capital shitty, but I'm gonna use it. Having capital troops is probably smarter. Okay. Green and red are in Spain. See if that if let's see if hitting a green four. Triggers a break here. I'm very curious to see if we get that break. Or if Green's happy to just... I'm also curious to see if this breaks that way. We now have a bot in blue. Yeah, I'm going to lose my my two. To, it's going to break to Narek. Ah, we're going to go no bonus. We're going to lose both our bonuses this turn. Yeah. Well, serves me right for fucking with this bot. The Revenge of Blue. Okay. Hopefully green doesn't... Uh, hopefully green lets me hold North Africa. I bet you they break, though. They're thinking about it. They're trying to figure out how big I am. Oh, they just want Spain? Interesting. No, they're going to break on the other side. Fair enough. Yeah, fair enough. They break on the other side. All right. He knows where the cap is, so he doesn't open it. He doesn't know where the cap is, so he does open it. Great. Great, great, great. Okay, cool. Put your troops. <clears throat> you just leave them there. Okay. Do I beat the shit out of green? That's a possible line. Do I just pummel him? How much you pose on his capital, though? His cap is there. I think not opening his cap is probably smarter. And where do I establish advantage? This is what I was thinking, right? I was thinking of setting 
adding to the 11, cut down, and then break, break. So to hit a 7 and a 9, but how much does he have on his cap is the question. Um, and the answer is probably too much. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break the bots bonus behind me. I'm going to add, like, nominal amount of troops there. Um, maybe actually take most of Italy? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe the bot goes back and breaks. I don't care, right? Having two capitals right now is really key. <laughs> no one really sees this one, so I can keep it a touch weaker. Um, but 17 is more than enough, right? Now I don't need to worry about green. I'm not going to reopen his line. Red finally starts with... No, red still doesn't have Orient. As soon as they do, we're going to start to see them poke out into here, and that's when I need to worry. Maybe someone's interrupting them. Green also sees everything I'm doing, so maybe green might break me here. Or the bot, right? I'm not actually really expecting to hold Italy. Okay. Yeah, the bot. Hmm, gets a bad roll. Sweet. That's lucky. I think green still breaks, though. Green tries to do some fuckery. Once you break once, you kind of go attrition. <clears throat> Yellow's still alive. Okay, there's green. What are they going to do? Just hit me. Get a single take? Yeah, I don't care, right? I have a 17 cap there. What are you going to do? i let you hold your bonus. I don't care. Yeah, I'm guarding his position. <clears throat> Man, watch this guy have no troops on capital. Okay, so he's going to set first. He's going to get the four trade. I'm happy to let him get the four trade. The judge still getting 13 a turn. I think we bank troops this turn. We do something off a set next turn. I got lucky I didn't lose Italy there. Yellow quits. Yeah, yellow lost their capital. Okay, Magenta took yellow's capital. <laughs> this means Magenta becomes incredibly strong in the top left. Unless they're interrupted. Do we take the opportunity to try and interrupt? <laughs> then I'm at war with two players. Probably unwise. But I'm in the middle position, so I have to win one of the corners. Instead of retaliating, right, instead of setting in revenge on, on Magenta, which I'm surprised people don't do, he quits like a baby. All right, so how much yellow is left? Oh, no, he sets, but as a bot. Okay, I get 13. I think we invest on capital. Don't piss off. Magenta... see how this goes sitting on five cards yep red getting 14 now so i'm in the middle and my three opponents are in the corners uh magenta is here red is here green is here on the bottom right now i'm in two positions off two capitals holding two bonuses sort of holding two bonuses we'll see what holds and blue and yellow are bots <laughs> good line on the blue kill don't know what's in galicia don't know who's there. Um, see if blue sets. So I think it makes a lot of sense to push my advantage in this part of the board now. Because nobody's there. Yeah, blue ball going to break me again. Well, I did end his game, so it makes sense. This guy's going to be a thorn in my side. Okay. Blue bot on four cards. What does green do? Green sets, gets the six. Not enough to take the 18 cap. 
<laughs> breaks Italy. <laughs> or takes Spain. No, it just breaks Italy. Yeah, he's going to hit Switzerland. Watch. He is going to hit Switzerland. <laughs> Green, you are an insufferable prick. Yes. Good job. Oh, it goes the other way. Yeah, Magenta now, as I said, super strong in the noob corner. Which sides of the board is he going to go? He has two directions. If he doesn't choose to hit me, he's going to go either this way or this way. Or through me. If he starts going through me, I'll see that. Yeah. So 14 is 1, 2, 3, 4 for the four capitals. Um, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, plus 5. Yeah, 14. He doesn't have all of it yet. He's cleaning out yellow from up there now. I have good lines on the blue kill, I think. He's finishing noob corner. Do I want two cards from yellow? I don't have high enough confidence on the kill. Yep. So we see Yellowbot doing some attacking. The pummeling. And green afford. Deal with that. I think green might have tried to address magenta here. Which is very interesting, if true. Do have a set on three. Okay, red sets gets the 12. Very curious about what red does. We start to see some red here. Or they're working on Russia. Yeah, red's playing it slow. Got to remove that red to exterior so they can't fuck around with the board. All right, does blue have a set? They do not. Blue's on five cards. Cool. Okay, maybe I get the blue kill? Okay, what does green have? Five troops. Green got broken. How did green get broken? Their cap isn't here. Their cap isn't here. Oh, please roll that. Please roll 18. Yeah. <laughs> Ho, 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 ho. Their cap is noob corner, folks. Their cap is noob corner. Green's cap isn't even there. Uh huh. Okay. So I can set kill blue. What did they start with? Pull a nine out. What did they start with? I'm so confused. Start with five. They do still have their cap. Their cap is there. Their cap is there, but then they didn't hold the bonus. Right, because red broke them here. Oh, I'm dumb. The bonus is split too. That's why. Okay, figured it out. Red finally backdoored them. So I have the green kill. I have the green cap take. Purple's going to try kill blue, I think. Yes. Magenta, rather. Blue dies. Magenta's going to set again. <laughs> okay, this is very dangerous. Does he run out of time? 
This is very dangerous. Magenta going to be super strong. Yep. Okay. That at least increases the value of my set. Mm -hmm. Gets the 25 trade. Maybe he gets a yellow here as well. Reds is a good game. Yeah, this is where he breaks me. Okay, so yellow's on three cards. I can kill them and go card neutral, which I think I want to do. Or I can get the green capital. And I kill green and yellow. Maybe. That's a line. That is actually a line of play. Kill green and yellow. Yeah. I think we do that. That will set us, right? No. Still doesn't set us. Green's only holding one card. Um, just kill yellow. Go card neutral. And then... Deal with green on a future turn. Yeah, because green's not worth anything right now. And I see all of them. Green is only here and here. We see the whole map, guys. Likely have a set on four. You can kill green next turn. We do have a set. Good. All right. Does red address magenta? Come on, red. Be the noob I know you are. Slam the stack. He's not... Let's hit a 12, though. <laughs> okay, helps me a bit with green. So, is Magenta more likely to hit me who's open or red who has guard stacks? And green's going to take a card, I don't care. Green's feeding me their own kill. Yeah, whatever you do doesn't matter. Hits the cap again. Breaks a bono. Yep. Cool. You die next. Tragic. How could it happen to such a nice guy? Maybe I'll wait for green to have one more card. Job green. Super curious about what Magenta does here. Magenta almost in a dominating position. I haven't fucked with them all game. They're hitting down at a new corner into green. Yes, into green. They're going to get the green kill on two cards. That will set them. Good thing I have a set again. All right, this is where we try to address Magenta. After they get the green kill, the trade is... The trade is 40. I'm going to get the 45. Or they feed it. No, they have the time. Unless they start hitting unnecessary shit. Uh-huh, you're only three territories left. Two territories left. They get the kill. <laughs> yeah. Green dies. Good. Okay. Genta now gets a 40. Do they try and address red? Or do they hit Pete finally? They hit Pete finally. They steal a capital. Fuck. Fuck. 
Well, Magenta's slow. They don't steal the capital. They do. Okay, lose 26 on a... Okay, and so I'm out of that pocket. But I do have cards. Yep. Out of that pocket, do have cards. But give me my cat back. Yeah, give me my cat back. I don't even put anything on there. Guy has no troops on any of his capitals. Okay. We have four of the six capitals. There was a London cap and a Denmark cap. Uh, red's going to go down and take that, the green one off of, yes, off of Magenta. Perfect. And then Red's going to find me. So Magenta has gone from a winning position to a losing position in a single turn by not guarding his capitals. Red stole... The Magenta Capital, you see, now they have nothing. They have no capitals at all. Do they have cards? Have they bought it from that? Yes, they bought it from that. Fuck yeah. All right, you suck. Guard your capitals. Ladies and gentlemen, the lesson there <laughs> is put troops on your capitals. Uh, <laughs> he went from a winning position to a losing position in a single turn. Magenta actually played quite well, in my opinion, but they're new and they're slow. And eviscerating them like that was absolutely the right decision for me at the time. So I think I don't upset um, Red yet. I want Red to realize that... I want Red to realize how dire the situation is later than now. Do they set before me? Maybe. Red will see that if I hit that. So I don't think I hit that. Um, what, do I, what do I need to do here? Nothing. That's perfect. That's a good board position. Some troops on my capital, I think. Yeah. Okay. So we have four capitals. We have 33, 27, and two 13s. Sitting on three cards. Red gets 15. I have a set. Okay. Cool. This is good. Now Red explores the middle of the board. Yeah. Perfect. Stops, right? He's still worried about magenta. Yeah. Great. This guy's going to help me kill magenta. Magenta block in a set, though. <laughs> yep, that's fine. Break me a little bit. I understand. I wonder how much red has on this, ca on the green capital. Be my curiosity. Yeah, and then there's nowhere for him to go that way. Perfect. Okay. Now I can fuck up red. Yeah, and they put on the cap. Okay, so I just don't open, right? I never open these territories. I'm going to go all the way around. Mess with red. They probably have a stack block, would be my guess. Actually, we don't think we need to set here. Yeah. Beat him up. Beat him up. Let them go this way. It'll open a 13 cap. Good. This is good. And we get a joker. We get a set and a joker. 11 still. 
because they have the North Africa bonus. And, the, and I specifically didn't open either of their capitals, right? So green's cap is either here, here, and red's cap is here. So we don't open this territory, this territory, or this territory ever, so they can't use capital troops to hit me. So I keep them in their pocket, right? I keep them controlled. They might be quitting the game now. Good. And that's a GG. Everyone quits. Like, play it out, right? How are you supposed to learn? Sure, you're going to get beaten, but how are you supposed to learn how to play if you don't play it out? Ha, huh, there was a red stack in there in Netherlands. I love that. Yeah, yeah, sure. Okay, you broke one of my bonuses. I'm getting fucking 40 troops a turn, dude. <laughs> I like that, though. I like that a lot. Confuse the bot. Let the bot hit you and not me. Bots on five cards, bot sets, gets the 50. Do I lose a capital? 51 v 27. We might see that. We might actually see 51 v 27 here, but I think it probably hits red, red troops. Yeah, red troops. Cool. Red's still here. Red's still here. All right. I'll prioritize killing the bot. I'm a nice guy. We have enough troops to do it, right? Let's just make sure. In a pinch, I pull off that capital. Yeah, we got enough troops. Kill the bot first because at least Red stuck it out and didn't quit the game. Oh no, we don't have enough troops. Fuck. <laughs> don't do that. Stop feeding. I did it wrong. I am the dumb. Yeah, Red's not going to get it. Unless bot sets on three. If bot sets on three, I have to kill Red. Oh, no, he does. He sets. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. The Red's slow. Watch the bot just fucking set on. Ooh, maybe he steals that 16 cap. He hit. Hit it. And? And? Hit it. Lose all your troops. Yeah, 21. Okay, dece. That's half his turn. <laughs> You're not going to get very far if you don't hit me super hard now. I have the whole board. <laughs> Watch the bot totally set. Ah, I called it. Fuck. All right, fine. Fine, fine, fine. I cannot be an altruist this game. I'll just kill Red. I'm always punished when I try to be an altruist as well. I think I should just play to win the most efficiently, most efficient way I can. Yeah. Break, break, break. That's fine. I still have so much board. How much do you think he has on that lower cap? Do we take a look yet? The roll. It's not a great roll. Now we have cards. All right, you got nine troops. What do you do? Retake Orient. It's going to hit a purple or magenta 14. This goes down. Retake Africa. Yeah.
He pulls troops off capital to threaten the seven. Alright, I should definitely stop letting the bot get bonuses. It's gonna keep breaking me. Yeah. Need to keep it out of the middle. He does have a set. Okay. What happens with your set? <laughs> Just cleans the pocket. Yep. Nice. All right, this time I will actually be an altruist and kill Magenta. sees I go all the way around. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> Red two capitals are locked. Got five cards. Can't really hit me. We tie the noose. Well played. Good game. What happens when you try to be altruistic, folks? You almost lose. <laughs> nice. Well played, buddy. He sees it. Doesn't even take a card. Nice. 102 stack on his capital. I mean, the other one is free? Yep, the other one is free. <laughs> nice. Feels good, folks. I don't think that anyone was quite good in this game. And let's see the ranks. 
as I said, folks, thank you for watching. Um, I have a daily release on both my YouTube channels. Uh, daily release on Free Pete, a daily release on the Kill Pete strategy. We do weeknight streams on Twitch. That's Toronto time. So I stream in the evenings. Yeah. Uh, four beginners and one novice. And if you would like notifications for when my next videos go live, click the like, click the subscribe, click the notifications. Do all the things, folks, that help support me in my work to grow risk into his destiny. I love you. I appreciate you. And for all of you on the path to world domination, good games and good luck.